Hi guys, Tashi here from Pixie Mommy's Reborns. Okay, this is a total just hop on. You're gonna have to excuse all the dust and grime and mess and I will explain. We just had our mattress delivery, which I'll talk about. Oh, and I didn't even clean the stove off this morning. You just please excuse everything. Um, hold on, babe, one second. Um, so I, I <laughs> came to say hello to everyone. All right, shh, shh. So I just had my mattress delivery, which I will talk about in a later uh, video, how happy we are that we finally got new mattresses, okay? So I had a king size, and it was one of those, I forget what you call it, but it was like an oversized king size mattress. One of those Tempur-Pedic, really soft, very uncomfortable for me, very bad on my back. I haven't been able to sleep on my bed. Um, and I have not been able to get to like the very, very back behind or the very, very middle with the vacuum or with everything because my room's very small and it was crammed in there. It was a mis you know, it was an accident that I had ordered the king last time we got mattresses, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, uh, I am sharing, I found this, uh, this was my daughter's, John Lennon, this was her, the, the little, you know, spare diaper bag that went with the big one you know, um, and I had no idea I had this under the bed. Now, of course, you're going to see all the dust bunnies. It's all disgusting. You see it coming off. You know, obviously, I'm going to wash this up, but I didn't want to pass up the opportunity to share this excitement because I found that there are some things inside here. So, come on with me. Let's see what's in here. I'm so excited just to find this John Lennon. And I'm already seeing these type, the type of shoes that I was actually looking for. And hang on, I will have to unzip. Um, I was talking about the, I mean, these aren't the exact type, exact shoes that I was talking about in like the classic baby shoe, but it's kind of that look. And um, these are really cute. I obviously got them for... I don't know if I had these for a cabbage, a doll, or one of my kids. I don't really remember. Um, I'm pretty sure I had packed this up, uh, you know, with, like, doll stuff. With stuff for, like, Cabbage Patch dolls. So, we have some Pampers. Um, I don't know how good these will be. I mean, they were in plastic. Um, the, sh the little shoes are definitely in good shape, and they're very small. Um, assuming maybe they... Uh, might be newborn size yes they're size zero so these are hard to find in my opinion anyway um they're not as soft as like you know the the nice really expensive leather ones but you know i i didn't want to spend that much on a shoe for a doll uh let's see what else we have in here um okay so this is just like a it's actually like a short sleeve hospital shirt or no, that's bad. Yeah, it's just like a white, uh, almost looks like a hospital shirt. It's a zero to three months with like the green thread trim on the, but it's short sleeve on the sleeves and on the bottom, but that's cute. I seem to remember, I think I had this on my Cabbage Patch doll head, my, my first Cabbage Patch doll. It's like ringing a bell cute little hat with little it's a it's just a little um newborn sleep cap blue and it has um little doggy footprints on it <clears throat> oh this dust is killing me oh my gosh uh i probably should have done this outside but it's very rainy Ooh, ooh, is this nice ooh, um all right, so this is like a velour uh, newborn uh, sleeper. It's white. It has a Peter Pan collar. Uh, away from fire. I'm trying to see what brown this is. Uh, on the front, it says La Petite. Oh, ooh, oh something not in English. <laughs> um, it. That's a. Oh, let's see on this arm. Does anybody know this brand? It's maroon. Uh, I can't even read. It's in script. It's something with an M. 
MI and MMM. I don't know. I don't know. But what a nice, um, it has, oh, oh my gosh, guys, look! Oh, not only does it, is it super cool, but, oh, it, look, is it missing a button? No, 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 because it buttons up like this. It has buttons in the back and it has one of the trap doors on the back. Oh my gosh. See, I'm so glad that I opened this with you guys, even though it looks all disgusting. I'm so sorry. Like, you're all like, oh, she had that under her bed. Uh, but how exciting. <laughs> oh, and this is a little Winnie the Pooh um, jacket. Oh, there's a stain. There's a stain. Eh, maybe I could get it out. How cute is this? <gasps> Oh my gosh. Oh, and the back too. I better get out the OxyClean and all the stuff and see if I could get this um, this stain out. I'm pretty sure I have the pants because they're this like white kind of almost waffly print and I could swear that it said Winnie the Pooh inside, inside the, the pants that I have. I've had them on Ben. So it was probably a complete outfit that I had, I'm, I'm thinking this stuff was Gabe's, <laughs> yes, <clears throat> Gabe's, and then I put away, <gasps> guys, look, oh my gosh, oh, first off, I didn't see this, the little baby alive binky, obviously, I, ha I did have a baby alive doll, these are little, I know that these are Cabbage Patch doll glasses, um, I recognize them, so, you know, the little cabbage patch with the glasses, obviously. I held on to glasses from one of the dolls. Cute. And a bottle, a, a toy bottle. This, um, it looks like it's, you know, very old and doesn't have the disappearing milk in it anymore. You can see that little brown spot in there. But um, it is a little toy play bottle. And then I see... Some actual Cabbage Patch diapers in the original packaging. And I see I obviously kept some tags from whatever Cabbage Patch doll I had that <laughs> I had this stuff for that I don't really remember. Another pair of glasses. When I tell you I collect Cabbage Patch dolls, I collect Cabbage Patch dolls. I still have some of my Cabbage Patch dolls out in a storage bin. And I still have Ted, my original Cabbage Patch doll, which I will at a certain point get out. I see somebody's birth certificate, Cabbage Patch birth certificate, Swale Quinton. This one does not ring a bell offhand. And I, I, I remember the names of lots of them, but that does not ring a bell. A uh, little pretend baby powder, Cabbage Patch. Obviously, I mean, I'm not doing anything with the Cabbage Patch stuff. And another package of diapers, Cabbage Patch. Now, I see the plastic has the Cabbage Patch, but if you open it up, it's just going to be a plain white plastic disposable diaper, which they probably have that nice crinkly sound that I like, those old-fashioned diapers. So that's pretty cool. I'll probably use these. Uh, and uh, the glasses are real, real small. Um, I don't think these would fit a reborn, maybe, but they're not really, I don't know. It's just cool. It, it was just like a little treasure find under that. Oh my gosh, was it just terrible under there in the parts that I could not reach. Um, so yeah, we're in the midst. Um, my daughter really got in there for me. And because of course, when the guys were here to switching the mattresses, I couldn't make them stand there and wait while I vacuumed and moved stuff. So, you know, I just had them set it up. And uh, Destiny was very nice and pulled the rest of the stuff out and has been vacuuming for me and working on that. She put a mask on. Um, because when I tell you, I just physically could not reach and I couldn't lift, you know, it was just, um, not a good situation, which is why I, you know, changed it as soon snack? as I could. Can I have a food snack? No, not now. It's too early. So anyway, guys, I just wanted to share this little treasure find as you got to see the stuff with me. It's always cool when you find something in the back of a closet or stored away, especially when it's like dolly related, that, you know, hobby related, that something fun that you haven't seen in a while, you know, most of the stuff I recognize and um, it's just fun. 
I, you know, it just, I had the urge to pop on the camera and say, you know, it said, let me share this all with everybody. Now, obviously, you can see, I mean, the diaper bag, you know, that dirt is probably just from being, you know, under the bed. But I think I could clean this up really nice. And it is now another John Lennon piece. Um, as uh, to those of you that have been here a while, you know that I do collect the uh, John Lennon items because that was my... Um, daughter uh noelle my 17 year old daughter that was her nursery and then used for two more of my children um, my oldest daughter they did not have the john lennon out uh, when she was the baby so that's it and like i said the stew i didn't even clean all i think my daughter made eggs this morning it didn't even get clean but um so just please excuse everything guys um but i i wanted to to just, you know, like I said, for you to see what I was seeing. All right, I won't yap on. <laughs> Just sharing my little treasure find. All right, everyone, God bless.